Hi everyone, I'm Jeff in Raleigh, North Carolina. Today we're looking at the Army Green choices in TRD Pro. Of course in TRD Pro, Tundra or Forerunner or Tacoma or Sequoia, you can get Midnight Black, Army Green, Super White or Magnetic Gray. So let's just compare and contrast deciding between a Tundra and a Forerunner and see where that gets us. Forerunner is tough, it's rugged, it's dependable, it's perfect for off-roading, designed with crawl control, multi-terrain select, pretty much everything designed to help you get in and out of sticky jams off the trail, on the trail, wherever you want to go. It has new smart key, auto open on both the driver and the passenger side. It comes with two rows of seating and then for the third row you can get it empty or you can get a sliding rear cargo deck. It has black soft tech seats with red accent stitching and you'll see I'll show you the TRD logo everywhere in the truck. Here's the back of Forerunner TRD Pro. It's open. You can also get the sliding rear cargo deck like I mentioned and it has AC power. It's also got JBL speakers so it has the fullest richest kick and soundtrack, music, bass, whatever you want to call it, that you can play. That made no sense, but roll with it here. Yeah, I'm gonna need you to come in on Sunday too. Yeah, and we're now putting cover sheets on those TPS reports, yeah. Sorry about the wind, I'm trying to keep it down. It's a windy day though, folks. So we've got soft tech seating in this one right here. It's black with red stitching. Toyota has made a very wise decision to put standard rear USB ports so that everybody can charge. Nobody's going to fight over controls and stuff like that and who's going to charge. So it has sunroof in it and then I just really love the big open windows so it's very easy to see. I think the good SUVs and trucks are the ones that can minimize blind spots and Forerunner does a very good job of it. That's very cool. Let's go over to the front. It has all automatic windows here. Lumbar support. There's the TRD I was talking about does not have blind spot monitor. Certainly want to be aware of that one. This one has a redesigned, has a leather wrapped steering wheel, but redesigned 4.2 inch multi-information display in Forerunner, which gives you valuable information and they do it in a nice, easy format. And it has Toyota Safety Sense, ladies and gentlemen. That's pretty cool stuff. Here's what the console looks like. Nice and open, good place to put whatever you want. Sliding rear back window, which is nice. Dual temperature controls, JBL of course. They all have Sirius XM. This has dynamic navigation system, but with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, you can play pretty much whatever navigation app you like the best. I prefer Waze myself. It has a auto dimming and auto dimming rear view mirror, crawl control, which is a low speed cruise control and tough obstacles like sand and things like that, multi-terrain select. It's got active traction control and a locking rear diff so it locks both of the wheels on the same axle so that they all do the same work when you're trying to get out of a tough obstacle. It comes with uh, safety connect standard. And then you can see the, the rack. Nice rack, thanks. If you're looking for a TRD Pro with the most power, the most torque, it could be the Tundra. It has a 5.7 liter V8 engine. You match that with a six speed automatic transmission, 381 horsepower combined with 401 foot pounds of torque. Check out these 18 inch Nitto Ridge Grappler tires with the TRD wheels. And then notice the Predator Pro step bars on it. This is a good looking truck. Let's look around this Tundra here. It's got the TRD Pro exhaust. It's got that loud throaty sound to it. Now this one's a double cab with a five and a half foot bed, okay? You can also get the double cab that'll have a six and a half foot bed. 
This one has the spray-in bed liner. So sorry about the wind today. I'm doing my best. This one has black leather seats. Whereas the Forerunner has the soft text with red accent stitching. Look at all that leg room. Can you see a tall person here? Yeah, I think so. So much room. I would add rear USB ports to this one as an option. And then these seats, when I've been driving this one, incredibly comfortable with that leather. It's really sharp, really nice. And the truck, it's smooth, it's comfortable. It's a great city or highway cruising speed vehicle. Has an eight inch touch screen. Just like on the 4Runner, you can do Amazon Alexa, Android Auto, Apple CarPlay. It has the three USB ports up here. I still would do the rear USB ports, guys. Push button start, just like the 4Runner. It also has the tow haul and the trailer brake controls. This one has a really cool one. I'm gonna do a video on it pretty soon. It has the wireless charging, but look at this. It's got a built-in center console safe. I don't know if this is unlocked or not. No, it's not. Anyway, there's that one there. So that's a great option because you could put your valuable items that you don't want people getting to or you want to keep them private or secure. That might be a great option. Tundra comes with the original Toyota Safety Sense. It has LED headlights, LED daytime running lights, accent lights. And then it's also got the LED Rigid Industries fog lights. Yeah, that's sharp, sharp. And then our Forerunner friend also has Toyota Safety Sense. It has the LED fog lights. It has the projector headlights, daytime running lights. Oh yeah, we can look under here too. Cool. Thank you guys so much for watching. Look at my social media following page so you can follow me for different types of content on Instagram, on Facebook, on Twitter, and of course on YouTube. You can check out my website, my column. So many places to see me, you're gonna be so sick of me. Anyway, thank you guys so much for following. Which one of these do you like the best? Write them down and we'll see you next time.